This is going to be a video tutorial on how to enable or disable the home button in the DuckDuckGo web browser. I will be using a desktop PC for this. Let me jump over to my browser here. I have the DuckDuckGo web browser opened up now. If you look off to the upper left hand corner up here, you can see I have a little icon of a house up here that is my home button. If I put my mouse cursor over it, it says home. You can tailor this uh, home button to take you to whatever website that you want to. But to enable or disable the home button, first thing you want to do is open up settings. I'm going to go off to the upper right hand corner, up to where you see the three dot hamburger menu. I'm going to click on that. Then I'm going to go down to where it says settings. And I'm going to click on settings. Now in the pane off to the left hand side here, I'm going to click on the general tab. And then right down here under where it says home page, at the very bottom, home button and toolbar. If you click this drop down, gives you three different options. You could hide the home button. You can show the uh, home button to the left of the back button or to the right of the reload button. I have mine set to the right of the reload button. You can see the check mark there. That's what I have it set to. But that is how to enable or disable your home button. But if you want to set a custom home page along with your home button, you want to toggle on the bottom thing here. The top thing says new, new tab page. The bottom thing says specific page. As you can see, I have my home button set to uh, take me to uh, YouTube. But to set it, you just click on set page. And right in this dialog box here, you would paste the URL of the website that you want to make your home page. Then you would click on OK. That is how to enable or disable the home button in the DuckDuckGo web browser. Thanks for watching.